Hello and welcome back. Right here, we're finding out about the Dark Mime God. Taiko is visibly shaken. The book? Right, the book that revealed every mime's true service. Their deeper calling, the Necrowombicon. Necrowombicon? It's an awesome name! There's kind of a cute munchkin on the cover, but don't be fooled by that shit. We did 666 birthday parties to fund it. But our expedition to the mysterious east claimed a dark prize. Here we go, another video clip. Here, stupid fucking wall. Indiana Mime in the Temple of Bunnies. Awesome. I'm out, bitches. <laughs> Who is this mysterious dark figure? That's ridiculous! We had the Necrowom being in for study at the old academy. It's not some tome of forbidden mime law. It's completely blank! Hook is the biggest hoax in the history of apocalyptics. I assure you, it's no hoax. The book may be gone, but its power is not. Even now they work throughout the city, con consummating its profane commandments. It's too bad, too. I'm actually very fond of existence. And you were hanging around with these guys, why again? It was like a peer pressure thing. Y you know how it is. I was at this party once and everybody started worshipping this elemental form of evil. I just wanted to be cool, you know? So then they started passing around that cursed idol. Alright, so yeah, evil god, what can be done? Oh, you can't stop it. It's impossible. Their god's the dark hush of the Evernight. Oh look, another person who needs help. I'm trying to work up the courage to go in there, actually. Back into the... When I left, I had to leave quickly. And quietly. Well, yeah, that makes sense for people like you. I left behind three tools I'd need if I ever wanted to mime again. Regular mime, not murder the entire universe mime. There's no doubt past my shit around now themselves. My invisible rope, my invisible briefcase, and invisible stairs. He wants us to find invisible stuff. Why the fuck not? Yeah, we'll, we'll keep an eye out. Thank you. Well, not an eye, because all the shit is invisible. But, but yeah. It's appreciated. Let's wave goodbye. You wave goodbye. The x man waves at you. A gigantic, exaggerated wave, like a beauty queen from the deck of a ship. It is a wave with quiet power. I love this game. Now, as you can see over there, there's a bunch of carnival games we have to play. Now, we really have to play all of these, trust me. Crab fact. Crabs are fucking crazy. Fucking knew it. I've always said to people, man, crabs are crazy. And you'd be like, huh, no, they're not. And I'm like, they are, bitches. Yep. Clouds are our enemy here. As you notice, we now have Burisha. Now, she's a bit special. You see, her attack gets stronger the more times you use it. So basically, you just want to use the hell out of it the minute you get it. Now these clowns, they bleed rainbow blood! How awesome is that? Rainbow blood. You know, for kids parties and shit. Aha. These guys are quite deadly whenever they get started. They usually speed themselves up first. Boo shibap. Damn. I'll show you a few issues now. Rainbow attack! Boom! It's a super colourful explosion. Sure, it's pretty shitty right now, but trust me, it gets a lot better. A lot better. The more you use it, the bigger the explosion gets, basically. I'm not kidding, eventually it gets the size of the planet. Ah, bollocks. 
not good at that anymore. Jeez, oh! These guys are also fast as shit, so you're not gonna see their attacks come unless you look very close! Sadly, we lost Taiko. There we go, take down some mines. Awesome! Up you get, man. And for our troubles we get two explosive clown noses. These volatile clown parts must be handled with care. <laughs> Flying pricks. Aim the ones with the left stick and press X to throw. Pop as many as possible. I'm not very good at this in case you haven't figured it out. Awesome, we get a token. Now I'll show you something really fun. Urgh, take that! Kill him! Yeah, you get the point. Now what you have to, basically you do that a number of times. And you get more and more shit as you go on. Now let's take a quick tour around, we go up here. And we will meet some more clowns. Let's just quickly dispatch these dudes. Ah, no, he has to go first. Doodaloo, doodaloo, that's some catchy ass music. Damn. So you just need to watch that a bit closer. See? 50 damage now. The longer you keep it going, the more damage it eventually starts doing. That was a bit weird. Damn! I think I'm going blind. Or I'm just sort of not seeing the big white bar. There we go. Getting the hang of it now. Yeah, there we go. Getting there, bit by bit. New Tommy gun looks awesome, doesn't it? It's like a robot Tommy gun. It's like super Tommy gun. It's gonna ship Robocop and walk around town with. Ah, you're not gonna hit me with your shoe, stupid clown. Ah, you bet me, the douchebag. We club him to death. Oh. Hit him with stuff there. Boom! Ow! Bitch. Ow! Ow! God damn it! The speed went down because he bit me. Get me this. There we go. Boom! Clown giblets! Yep. And their middle finger remains. Use Fuisha again. No, trust me, you want to use the hell out of this thing. Boom! Getting a bit bigger, isn't it? Awesome. Another 500 experience for our troubles and another two cloud noses. Now, over there's a barbershop quartet. You have to fight all of them at once. But I'm not sure if you have to fight them right now, but you can fight them later. First, let's talk to this person. Azorda, huh? Would you look at that? Wonder if she still works. You studied these in school, right? Taiko's hand, Taiko's hand gently brushes the machine. I did. What's to know? Actually, you see. Oh, great. Metaphysically, there are a number of unique phenomenon associated with coin-operated divinities. It has to do with the kind of yearning a piece of equipment like this comes in contact with. All that human desire just accumulates in the machines, in the glass, in the wood. It suffuses them. Basically, they're like a demonic buffet. Something like 80% of them get possessed by evil spirits. I think I might have to go now. Okay, now my phone was ringing. Sorry.
What? That's all? Wow, we dodged a bullet. I, I think his thesis was on this shit. Step away from the machine and I think we'll just end the video here. Well, I'll see you guys next time.